shadow of purity. Once upon a time in the quaint village of Delta, there lived a young man named Jude. He was a simple fellow, known for his warm heart and gentle spirit. One day, as he strolled through the bustling market square, he laid eyes on the most enchanting maiden he had ever seen, a vision of beauty named Faith. She had eyes that sparkled like the morning dew and a smile that could light up the darkest night. Jude and Faith soon found themselves entangled in the threads of love. And before long, they decided to tie the knot. The entire village rejoiced in their union and the couple began their journey together with dreams of a harmonious life. However, little did Jude know that behind Faith's captivating exterior, there lay an obsession with Christian ideals of morality and purity. Faith was deeply rooted in her beliefs, which, while virtus, bore the red on the extreme. She insisted on following a rigid code of conduct, often shunning simple joys and pleasures that life had to offer. At first, Jude admired Faith's commitment to her principles, but as time passed, their home became a battleground of conflicting values. Faith's obsession with purity created an oppressive atmosphere, making Jude feel like he was walking on eggshells. Jude tried to reason with Faith, explaining that life was meant to be enjoyed in all its facets. He spoke of the importance of balance and the need for a harmonious coexistence between their love and Faith's ideals. Yet, Faith remained unyielding, convinced that any deviation from her strict moral code would tarnish the sanctity of their union. As days turned into weeks and weeks into months, the tension in their home grew thicker than the morning mist. Jude longed for the carefree days of their courtship, where laughter echoed through the air like sweet music. But Faith's fixation on purity cast a dark shadow over their once joyous life. Tragedy struck when the village was hit by a severe drought. Crops withered, and the once lively community began to wither away. The villagers, desperate and hungry, looked for solace in each other's company. Jude saw an opportunity to bring joy back into their lives. By organizing a communal feast, a celebration of unity and shared humanity. However, Faith vehemently opposed the idea. She feared that indulging in festivities during a time of hardship would be seen as an affront to their moral standing. Despite Jude's pleas and the villagers' desperate need for relief, Faith stood firm in her conviction. In a fit of frustration, Jude decided to proceed with the feast against Faith's wishes. The aroma of cooking wafted through the air and laughter echoed once again in Delta. The villagers, grateful for the respite, joined in the festivities. However, Faith, consumed by her ideals, distanced herself from the merriment. As the feast reached its climax, tragedy struck their home. A sudden storm swept through Delta, destroying what little remained of their crops and bringing chaos to the celebration. In the midst of the calamity, Faith realized the consequences of her rigid beliefs. Jude, devastated by the events, looked into Faith's eyes with a mixture of sorrow and understanding. It was in that moment that Faith's obsession shattered like fragile glass. The storm served as a metaphor for the tumult they had experienced in their marriage, and Faith, finally humbled, embraced Jude with tearful regret. In the aftermath, the couple faced the daunting task of rebuilding not only their home, but also their relationship. Through shared struggles and newfound understanding, they emerged stronger than ever. Faith learned that love could coexist with joy, and Jude discovered the importance of respecting and navigating the intricacies of his partner's beliefs. The lessons gleaned from Jude and Faith's tale are many. First and foremost, the importance of balance in a relationship, where love, joy, and moral principles can peacefully coexist. It teaches us that extremes even in pursuit of virtuous ideals, can lead to strife and heartache. In the tapestry of love, each thread must find its place to create a harmonious and resilient bond. For couples walking down the path of love, the advice is simple. Communicate openly and honestly. Seek compromise 
and be willing to embrace the diversity of beliefs within the sanctity of a shared life. Love is not about erasing differences, but finding beauty in the unique colors each partner brings to the canvas. And so, the villager of Delta, once shaken by discord, was transformed into a beacon of resilient love and understanding. Jude and Faith became symbols of a love that weathered storms, teaching generations to come that true harmony is born, not in the absence of conflict, but in the shared journey of overcoming it.